Hello there. It is time once again for Civilization IV Caveman to Cosmos. Of course, I am your mercurial host, Grimith. And what I remember from last session, things didn't go that well. Uh, I, I became big people, and no, no, that happened two sessions ago. Last session, I made an army, and I moved to hurt the Incans, although I had some concern. No, I... Lots of things happened last session. <laughs> <laughs> That's what matters. What what matters is that we're here right now, folks. And we did hurt the Incan Empire, and I took two coastal cities. Cities which uh, have extra trade routes and are doing some trade-related things, actually, with some of my cities, which is not so bad. Now, uh... I didn't want to take any more cities because of how I'm losing money right now at 100%. And I want to stop being so deficit. And to do that, I will, of course, need to fix my economical situation. Economic situation, once again. Vitkos here is nice because it has three great military instructors and a great merchant. Very spiffy, that. Uh, in time, I will want to build some uh, naval vessels here to try to protect... Um, my sea access, that is a tropical coast, and it does not have a fishing boat there anymore, I do not think. Uh, so, that's, that's, that's of some concern. But, that's something for the future. It looks like I, uh, was building a road down here, uh, using two workers to, uh, build this network up here. Uh, someone, uh, suggested several days back and I construct a fort somewhere along here so to completely solidify my borders in this situation. Someone else also suggested, you know, putting like a fort in there or somewhere around here to plug in the rest of these places. Which I could do. You look interesting. Right. I've expanded far and wide, and I need to wait for my my several new settlements to catch up now before I build any more new settlements. I don't think I want to do anything at the moment before I end this turn. <coughs> some folks have some gold that I could attempt to acquire. Uh, Brennus here... Uh, I do believe he was demanding a city from me, which was rather rude of him, I think. And uh, not acceptable behavior, I don't think so, I don't think so. Uh, the least valuable thing is naval warfare. I can trade naval warfare to a bunch of people for some money. I could even try to get lead working, but we saw how well that went whenever I tried to get a technology from someone. Uh, you already have dualism. Let's see here. Was there something else that other people have? Uh, you... I know, I know. We're doing some comparisons here. You don't have math... M Maybe you just can't get math right now. Maybe that's it. Can he research mathematics? No. Doesn't look like it. So, we can try to trade around uh, naval naval uh, warfare to a bunch of people and uh, claim some money from that. And we can trade you apiculture, I think. That might be a value. Or uh, fungiculture, rather. Let's uh, go through my friends here. Friends, in quotations. And, uh, offer some trades. Now, he will give me quite a sum of cash for that. He'll actually give me all of his money. Uh, what about naval warfare? You will definitely give me all the money, too. Uh, I can offer you board games. Everyone has board games. But I think everyone I can talk to right now has fungiculture as well, so... Whoa. Ah. Okay. 
Fungal Culture would be the one I want to trade because of its least value, and that'll be acceptable for me. Let's go ahead and accrue some cash so that I can spend some turns uh, doing some speed purchasing, which I don't think is a bad idea. I think I'm going to trade him... Uh, well, no, right, not you. I think I will offer you Fungal Culture as well. Don't you tell me to get on with it. What do you know, right? <laughs> Fungal culture. Good. We're going to use this to collect money that I can end up using to uh, speed purchase some structures or units. Uh, something I might end up doing is uh, flipping back to mercenaries and then uh, getting out a lot of, um, of town guards to provide superior protection with the promotions. It sort of depends on how... Uh, how lazy I'm feeling, I guess. Okay, it'll be fine. Let's go ahead and clean up by uh, collecting some money and uh, turning one tech into a lo You know what, fine. That, that, well, what about this? Hey, you know what? I'll take that instead. I will offer you my money and buy a tech. That'll be good for me. And suddenly the money vanished, right? <laughs> okay. And... We're moving down the list here. What do you want, stupid San Martin? I want to give you naval warfare so that you learn how to combat people on the seas. Good, good, good. Hey, do you want to actually, like, make a, a smart deal? No, you want the city of Napoli. Nap. Woo, we got Ledor! On a farm. Damn it. Well, I'll send one of these workers to it eventually. It's apparently my only source of lead ore, so I'm definitely interested in acquiring it. The world turns. I'll keep my money for the time being. I don't know how this situation might change, and I see no reason to uh, inconvenience myself for the time being. Oh boy, turn cycle. Mmm. We also have the Tomb of Cyrus, which allows great generals to cheat death. That was a building in which I had significant interest. I think I'm uh, going to be intelligent with what I'm doing. And I was chopping down this. Or I was going to, I guess. I think I'm going to be intelligent, and by that statement, what I mean is... I'm going to use my money to... Speed purchase buildings in the capital. As it is uh, so far behind. Uh, that's a lot of money for something that'll finish in two turns. We'll let that roll off. <clears throat> okay, okay, let's keep going. 1347 beakers per turn. Losing 65 gold per turn. Uh, someone also suggested, uh, and I don't remember the name, might have been Need Bacon. Uh, killing my research slider. Uh, for a long while, and uh, rapidly uh, buying up infrastructure in my cities. Which is a possibility. Indian Monastery? I think I'll grab that. That sounds useful. Strategic Grain Reserve? That's a thing. How about you get a monastery? And you go back to being awesome. Alright. I got a missionary here. I wanted to make those. Wanted to spread the glory of my religion to two cities, I think. And apparently I'm building three of them. That's not exactly something I want. Uh, let's go ahead and scroll you over here. I will move you down to Roma first. Alright. Uh, elephants sitting out there. I don't think there's a path that he can use to... Move two spaces to inconvenience me. Suppose if he does, well, good job for him. <laughs> good job for him. Let's, uh... What do I want to do with you? Eh, we'll 
mine this time. We'll keep our eyes posted up here. Perhaps the elephant will prove me wrong. It secretly has two movement that it will use to screw me. No? Looks like, uh... Oh no, he's threatening my worker, everyone. What do I do? Huh. Looks like my recorder's interface has changed. OBS got an update. And I uh, was just looking it over and noticing that, uh... The buttons on the recorder are in a different place. Completely irrelevant. Also, no. A grocer... Uh, hmm. Oh, let's get a monastery. Here, we want... I guess a cultural thing. I'll go along with that. Yeah, sure. Now, to try to attack this elephant here that has combat 3... And extra bonuses versus mounted units. Well, for starters, I couldn't reach it anyway. I could not, I could not. Well, I guess I'll have to run then. Oh, you stopped me from finishing the road. You, you incredibly vile, foul cretin, you. How could you do such a thing to me? The world will know of your great evil, and it will shudder and... Stuff. Yeah. Also, it seems like I fixed my money problem. I think someone celebrated we loved a chieftain day. Yep. That was Vitkos, actually. That's good. I'm glad they loved the chief. We're getting torches here next. Good. And we get a mausoleum. That's fine. Good. A mausoleum. <laughs> Gotta clean up some of that infrastructure. Alright, elephant, you wanna move next to Vitkos? Oh Oh noes. I must save the forest. It's nice to actually have money again, because that means I can make some sacrifices like that. No, you want to move there. I can't do anything about that. You win for now. Well, I'm, I'm glad it selected everyone. That's good. Fortify. Make a mud path. Uh... I mean, if you're gonna be like that, then... I'll just, uh... I'll go here. Hang out and play Nintendo. You know what? Screw that. You can't kill every bear. I simply find your tactics deplorable, sir. You can attack so many bears, but eventually... I will overwhelm your your elephant. I need to get, like, a spearman up here to poke the damn thing. Well, not need. I should consider it. I could even do it from the city and speed purchase it. Yep, obsidian spearman. It could be a thing. Plus 50% versus mounted. That would still be better odds. Yep. We'll maybe purchase that next turn. Because elephants are a problem. So are you going to attack in my stack of... You are. Let's see uh, Let's see how much that roughed you up. Because if we're trading one for one, I can do one for one. I have more cities than you do. I assume... Oh, the enemy's been spotted. Oh no, it sounds like people are trying to take advantage of the situation. It's crazy. Let's go ahead and produce a spearman up here, too. Let's go ahead and buy that for 522 gold. And select myself a bear here. Yay! You know, I didn't have to win that. <laughs> I could have gone bad. That was, uh, that was only marginally better than, uh, better than a coin flip. Only marginally. What are you doing? Mine. But Also, I have five times the strength of the Incan Empire. But because the AI is the AI, it will, it will do, it will do what it can to throw units away. 
Also, the Uzbeks are currently in anarchy. Good job, Uzbek Empire. You're doing wonderful. Oh, apiary here is done. Uh, two? Good. Two it is. Oh, looks like I had a bunch of people who just arrived. That's good. What do I want you folks to join the city as? I think production affiliated people. I like that. I apparently won't have that much of a problem with food and all. So, you know. Let's go ahead and get some production producing slaves. Good and... Interesting how the buttons change like that. The available buttons. There we go. Uh, next up, I'll just go ahead and have you do this directly. We'll go ahead and make our approach. Sentry up. And make the road. Fortify, and I have a spearman here. Let's go ahead and give you combat one. And... Combat 2? That'll be fine. And maybe I'll fortify you out here. That'll be good, for now. We're researching geometry. We have a... unit moving out into the wilderness. Standing on top of that hill, like it's going to do something. Oh, ship right here is done. Do I have any, like, other buildings? No, I, I have nothing that I want you to select. That doesn't mean I don't have anything I want you to build. Like a sail weaver. Let's focus on buildings. Uh, rock garden sounds nice. Sundial. Go ahead and get a watchtower. Caravan post. Town Patrol, because uh, crime will be increasingly a problem, I'm sure, over the passage of time. We'll make some candles, fish trap, sculptor's workshop, let's make a grove. Uh, we'll make a slave market, fisherman hut, meeting hall. Nah, we don't need that. Tuna nets, fish oil maker, school of rhetoric, Andean monastery, scriptorium, not a brothel. Uh, we can make a of that. A that, yes. Don't see the point of an assassin's den for the time being. A court? Right, courthouses, Grimoth. Courthouses. And this will be hotkey, I guess, seven. There's too many buildings. Yep, that's an Incan Empire hunter for sure. Wonder what it's up to. What you doing? Oh, Armenian Empire got a barbarian city. Good job, Armenians. Well played. Ah... Uh... Again, uh, going back to a, a point I've uh, made over the course of this series, there's just too many buildings and too many options, even in a game that's set on eternity speed. No, I can't. It's uh, rather frustrating. It uh, prohibits uh, sort of an ease of play that would be relaxing. Because there's just too much to consider and contemplate, and I do see that as a drawback. Some would not. Some would say the more options, the better. I want you to continue building paths. You guys are protected. I maybe should, uh... Well, maybe I should have not allowed that to happen. Like, taking care of that sooner, but I guess it's going to finish naturally. Actually, I want this courthouse done faster. Should have thought of it sooner. But, you know, that would have required me to be intelligent. Oh, which I'm not. Doesn't look like I can build it here. 
I don't see the gavel. I uh, don't meet whatever requirement the building has here in this city. Either that or it is... The button eludes me, which it might. But I don't think it does. And I'm feeling a little lazy and uh, researching that requirement. <laughs> so I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. Right, right, right. Spend money to build buildings and capital. I just uh, keep getting distracted in this. Uh, I'm not giving you the piracy technology. Charity begins at home, Grimith. Care to give us piracy? No, no, I I'm good. What's up? Holy crap! Holy... Whoa! Whoa! crap barbarians holy crap I, I <laughs> that is impressive I didn't know they could do that ah. you go barbarians that is that is a gift right there I, uh, I do have some fortification. There's a swordsman there, which is great at city attack. These units are so highly promoted, too. I, uh, I think I'm actually going to lose that city. Huh. Well, kudos. Kudos. I, I did not know that could happen. Huh. I've learned something new, and, uh, for my knowledge, I will pay a price. I could quickly attempt to buy a unit here, a bear rider. But that would burn through most of the gold, and I'm, I'm not sure whether it's worth that, really, for a city. I will... I, I, I can just rebuild that in the future. It's not a big deal. No, they've, uh, they've spread out. I was not expecting that approach. That is a lot of barbarian ships. Wow. That is... If in other sciences we should arrive at certainty without doubt and truth without error, it behooves us to place the foundations of knowledge in mathematics. That is a lot of barbarian ships. I, uh... I'll actually keep you over here. Nah, you keep centering. Oh, wait, the mud pass, the pass done? Uh, I'll have you bend down into this tile. This, uh... Huh. Uh, that's certainly a thing. I will grant them that. They might even, uh, be getting a surround off on me. I am uh, definitely not going to attack out into them. That's for sure. I, shall do I do want to attack these people, however. These ships, but there's so many of them. It's... It's kind of a big deal. I, uh... Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. One, and then I... No, then I wouldn't be able to move back into home. Home base. I think I'm actually going to retreat the navy here. I can rebuild what's pillaged as well. That is... Wow. That is certainly a thing that is happening there for sure. The barbarians have taught me. From them I have learned many things. I fixed that? I did. Okay. Uh, go ahead and move over here, and we'll see what happens. Well, 
What you doing, barbarians? Hanging out? Kind of reminds me of uh, how they used to operate in, uh... And, uh, Civilization 1, where they'd just kind of pop up on a boat and suddenly appear in your face and da-da. I do not have any cool promotions for you. And because of that, you are not actually guaranteed victory and might cost me a lot of money. I also don't want you to move like a... Stop dancing! Yeah, that's actually a problem. I, uh... Because that guy doesn't have any promotions, uh... He, uh, does not have the best chance of survival. Unfortunate that. I kind of feel like uh, I may have set my money on fire then. But, you know, it was... It was, it was a need-based thing, right? And I guess so long as they hold content and pillaging for the time being, I'm not going to be overly upset. I can rebuild that stuff. It won't take forever. Okay, I didn't get screwed. I like it. I killed the unit. That's, uh, that's, that's a victory there, believe it or not. That's progress. Yep, yep. Bad things are happening. Hello. How's it going, little hunter? Just gonna continue to hang out there? See what's up? Say hi to the people? I guess you can do that. It's your prerogative. Who am I to judge you, right? Ah, oh, boy. Terracotta Armory? No. No. Steals to no. Generates great general points based on game score. No. That. I like that. Prevents barbarians from entering borders on continent. You know, now that I know about this thing they can do here, I, I have been educated. And, uh, it has come to my conclusion that I no longer want this to be a thing which transpires. I've grown from this. I feel as if I have learned many things. As this wave of barbarians just, uh, gives my workers more stuff to do. Good job. Uh, well, no, you definitely need to heal. That is, uh, that is definitely a thing before you can go out and play. And, uh, oh, they're healing slowly. Just don't want to risk the ships. I don't want to risk them. It's a big deal. Go ahead and make a mud path here. Hello. How are you doing, bird? Hawk. Don't have time for your trash. I guess I could have let it attack into me, but I didn't feel like it. San Martin has adopted interpreters, a military tradition, there was a tragic mining accident, things happened, people were saddened. Let's move on with our lives. Baloney is still safe for now. Hello. I... You are, uh, you are... You are a barbarian on a mission. They've raided me with their... Their vile weapons of... Weaponry. Guess the barbarians are being intelligent enough to heal before they inevitably pillage everything I own. Oh! Oh! What do you have there? Look at that! My goodness! We might have ourselves an attack. You might try to legitimately retake the city. With that. You know, cause this cause that's that's gonna save his universe right there. Hello. My 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 bison just decided to move right next to you. I'd appreciate it if you didn't kill them. That'd be kinda rude. Yep. Going into turn, we'll see what happens. Oh, pests have moved away. It seems like that guy has commando, and I didn't realize, because he is definitely jacking my paths. 
I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, what was it? Eight? Seven? Seven. Good. Well... Good job. <laughs> Nicely done. I see you've taken a defensive position. Uh... Does it? I guess they're just allowed to use my mud paths. Well, alright. I guess, uh, that makes you happy. I'll be dealing with you, sir. And, uh, looks like the Incans retreated for the time being. Hello. I'm going to attack out of the city. But, you know, you're fully healed, so... And then you have a defensive advantage as well, so... Any of my opportunities to win are, uh, are moot now. Because that's, that's not a thing or anything. How about I go ahead and refer you back here as well. Move you here. I want you to keep making a road. Really do. Would really appreciate it if you, you stopped popping up all the time. Because of various threats you've undoubtedly perceived. We have made it great very far in this video. And now it's time to end it. Bye now.